Hey guys, uh, so I'm in Aspen. You might be wondering, what am I doing in Aspen? Well, I got an email a few months ago from someone from Kalia. And if you don't know what Kalia is, it's basically like Carrie Underwood's clothing line. So she's launching her new winter line. I think it's like fall and winter. For her launch, she and her team has, have invited, um, I think like 15 influencers and media people to come to Aspen to stay in like a house mansion thing and are basically kind of just taking them through all of the clothes Clothes. They're all gonna go skiing and do all these fun winter activities. There's a holiday party, which I was invited to, but I am not one of these influencers. I was invited to um, basically give all of the influencers and media a tutorial on how to pack for winter wear. It's like a three or four day event and all of the girls are gonna be staying in this mansion. Um, Carrie Underwood is gonna be there, so I'll get to meet her probably at the holiday party, which I'm so excited for. So that's what I'm doing here. I'm staying at this really awesome hotel. It's called the Jerome Hotel in Aspen. It is beautiful. I looked it up before I came here and it's like apparently one of the chicest nicest resorts here. It's pretty awesome. The view is spectacular. The weather is gorgeous. It's like 25 degrees outside. If you look closely, you can see the lift right there <laughs> to one of the, I think that's snow mass. And I got to meet some of the other girls who are in the media who are gonna be staying in the same hotel. So it's been a long day, but it's been a lot of fun. And like, I'm so excited. I guess I should explain like my, I'm here kind of on my own. Like I'm not here with those girls. I'm not one of the influencers. I am here as the travel expert. So I'm kind of like on my own in a way other than like tomorrow. So before I came here, I was like, what should I do when I go to Aspen? Like, should I go skiing? Cause like you go to Aspen you gotta go skiing it's like what you do I don't know if I'm gonna have enough time I have zero plans and I don't know what I'm doing but I'm excited I think they have like dog sledding I think that would be really cool I'm like pooped though I want to like take a rest and just like chill before I have to go somewhere Okay, so I'm vlogging on my phone because I didn't bring my camera, but I'm at the Kalia house right now. This is the Kalia holiday house. So beautiful. Everyone's setting up in there, so there's really not much to see, but this house is huge. I'm waiting for my Uber right now. I'm about to head back to the hotel and then go get something to eat probably downtown. Um, but so tomorrow is when the event starts. Everyone's gonna have breakfast and then we are going to get started. Can't wait to see what Aspen looks like at night. All right, you guys, I'm back at the hotel. I've been back for a little bit now. My hotel is already such a mess. Like, don't judge me. I just went basically over to the Kalia house to like, just do like a quick walkthrough. And then I took an Uber back. Um, it was so much fun. Carrie Underwood is gonna be here tomorrow. I just realized I don't have like a lot of time for like snow sports and stuff. Um, I really just have to like hang out tonight and I have to like come back and like Go over my tutorial again because I just want to be like ready for tomorrow. This is a hat I got in Ireland. I still love it and I never get to wear it so I'm happy. Anyway, I'm wearing this Kalia sweater. It is so cute and so cozy. Like I'm gonna wear gloves with it and I have my Kalia leggings. I'm just wearing my black Nikes. And then they gave me like all those free clothes, you guys, like all of that. I thought they would give me like some free clothes but they ended up giving me all of it. And then they gave me this duffel bag as well, which is so cute. And I think I'm actually gonna be taking it out tonight because I didn't bring a purse. So let's go get some food. I'm starving. <laughs> 
right outside of my hotel room. How beautiful is it? I like literally cannot believe the beauty of Aspen. The entire city is lit up like this, like it's crazy. I'm in search right now for a place to eat. Honestly, I've just been kind of like going with the flow, asking people who live here like, where's a good place to eat? I don't know, I'm just like walking. So there's a place right here. Looks pretty cute. Might check it out. Okay, little update, false alarm. That was a pet shop, but there's a place up here and it looks like it has a kitchen and there's heaters, so we're going. All right. $23, which isn't like a lot, but like I have so many phone chargers and I always lose them, so it just is kind of annoying. Sorry, I'll move my bag. I just like, I feel like this always happens to me. <laughs> what? <laughs> I feel like this always happens to me. It's like I travel somewhere and then I lose my phone charger or I leave it at a hotel. I'm sure many of you travelers out there can race. Hopefully it works with my new iPhone that I got. I think it'll be fine, but it's just like so frustrating whenever I have to like spend money on things that I don't need. I really hate that. But anyway, this place is really nice. It's pretty cool. I'm feeling the vibes. So, cheers. It is way colder outside than I anticipated. Aspen is so gorgeous at night. Like there's all these Christmas lights outside and it was really pretty. And then my fingers started like freezing off. The gloves I have are like Target gloves and I'm pretty sure they're not real leather and they don't do anything. Also that restaurant was really good but like the wait staff was kind of overbearing. I felt like a waiter kept coming up to my table on rotation. Like one would come up, I'd be like, good, I'm good. Another one would come up like after that person left and I would have food in my mouth. Mm -hmm. Doing good, doing good. And then once that person left, it was like the manager came over and I was just like, oh my God, I'm good. <laughs> Nonetheless, the food was good. All in all, I consider this a good night. Hasta manaro. <laughs> So at this point in the vlog, as much as I'd like to say that I woke up early and headed up to Snowmass Mountain, yeah, that didn't happen. As much as I wanted to go skiing on this trip, I was here for work and I really needed to practice my tutorial. So instead, I stayed back at the hotel, went over my script, and then headed up to the Kalia Holiday House. Okay, so I just got done giving my Kalia tutorial. Everybody's inside right now, but I thought I would just come out for a breath of fresh air because 
Y'all, that was hard. That was like really nerve wracking. I was very, very nervous, but I think I did pretty good. I think I hit all of the points that I wanted to hit. I've got my cute little candy cane earrings on right now, as you can see, and we're getting ready to go. Well, we're not going anywhere, but we're getting set up for the holiday party. So I think I'm gonna stay for the holiday party and then I'm gonna head out and probably, I don't know what I'm gonna do tonight. I haven't like thought about it, but this morning I didn't do a lot because I really wanted to prep for my tutorial and I just slept in and made sure I was well rested for my presentation. So sorry if that is very um, disappointing to the vlog, but um, yeah, no snow sports this morning. I just really wanted to make sure that I was, you know, representing the brand well, and I think I did. So I'll try to get a picture with Carrie. That would be awesome. But look how beautiful, honestly, like this is my absolute favorite thing about being here. It's just this view. I don't get views like this ever because I live in Florida. But anyway, I will get back to you guys soon. Okay, let's not drop our phone. Wow, guys, I have to say like this whole experience has really been incredible. Like Kalia, the team, um, Carrie Underwood, like everybody involved are just so wonderful. And then today what was cool when I was waiting to like go um, next to like speak, Carrie Underwood was introducing the line to all of the girls, like all the influencers and media, etc. One of the things that she said was like, we really want to make women feel empowered and like comfortable in what they're wearing so that they can like work out and feel good about themselves. It's just so crazy because that's exactly like what I felt when I was trying on all the clothes. I was like, wow, like if I wore this all the time, I would feel so good about myself. <laughs> it's really hard to find like really good workout clothes that you feel good in and that are like quality you know, clothes. So that is something that has really like been awesome to experience. I just, I'm so honored that I was able to be there. An event like this is something I don't take lightly. And I just think it's so cool that opportunities like this come by and I don't know, it's just, it just blows my mind that like I'm, this is even my job and that I can go to events and speak at events and do these kinds of things. This is so new, you know? I don't think people realize how new this is in the world and like these careers, like careers like mine are so new that it just kind of blows my mind that this is what I'm doing <laughs> with my life. All right, so I guess I'll see you tomorrow. Night. six hour layover in Dallas. I think I'm actually gonna start editing this video now. Although I haven't really like figured out how I wanna structure it. We don't know. I've got like six hours to kill. So probably gonna finish this movie I was watching on the ride over here. Um, it was called Where'd You Go Bernadette. It's a pretty good movie. I liked it, but I haven't finished it. I'm like 25 minutes. There's 25 minutes left of the movie. My hair is, I'm, I am so annoyed with my hair today. I don't know why it's doing this weird thing. <laughs>